Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel and today we are going to take a look at some of the major changes in Windows uh, 11 which was actually released to developers, brand new build of course and the latest build is the version 22533.1000 and we are going to take a look at some of the major changes in this build. But before we take a look, make sure that you are actually subscribed to the channel and also like this video for the YouTube algorithm. So Microsoft in this build is actually focusing on the narrator and they are actually pushing out the brand new natural voices which are now available in this build. And the two new voices which are now available are the first one is called the Jenny and then the second one is actually called area and you can also both download them from the windows settings application um, and they also introduced a quite a few of the keyboard shortcuts to the narrator in this build however some of the major ui improvements in this build is that if you play the song on the let's say the spotify or the supported windows player so if i play, click play on this song right here and I'll go right here to the quick settings. You'll see that we have the brand new widget right here. And this widget or this UI of the widget is also now present on the Windows lock screen. So if I lock my device right now, you'll see that this UI is also present right here on the bottom right. Uh, and this UI I think is quite a improvement from the previous Windows 11 build. However, they are also introducing a resizing of the application's UI improvement. Um, and so if I have the open file explorer on the left and the Firefox on the right, you'll see that if I move the actual windows, you'll see that we have the blur and also the icon showing right here. Let me show with the settings app as well. So if I put or pin my setting app somewhere right here, and I'll put it somewhere right here on the on the top right and Mozilla on the left and File Explorer right here. And if I switch between the windows right now, you'll see that all the icons are actually showing quite properly. And in my opinion, this is a quite of a UI improvement from the previous Windows 11 build. So the next major change in this build is that the actual volume indicator right now, uh, the brand new volume indicator also has the volume level right uh, now showing. So for example, here it says 80 there, these numbers were, weren't pr present before in the previous Windows 11 developer builds. Um, they also introduced a brand new uh, keyboard or the language switcher UI to all of the insiders. So if you haven't had the, this brand new UI in the previous Windows 11 developer build right now, you should actually have it. And it looks something like that. And in my opinion, it's also a quite a, of a improvement in, from the previous Windows 11 developer build. So one major um, UI change is also sh uh, shown in the Windows uh, system settings app so if i go to the storage right here you'll see that we have the brand new ui also showing or the um, brand new windows 11 ui also showing right here into the storage so temporary files and also apps and features are also now present in this windows 11 developer um, build so uh, one major fix which was present in this build is that the from the previous build there were actually two arrows on the bottom right on the taskbar and right now it's only one which is al also a functional one so the previous was this two arrows and one one wasn't actually functional and uh, yeah this is pretty much it for this video today if you haven't already make sure that you smash the like button and also subscribe to the channel it would be much appreciated have a wonderful rest of your day see you guys in the next video and peace out